Okay, if you're getting ready to throw a party, but you can't decide on what appetizer to serve, well, lucky for you, Coco contributor Colleen Ferreira has an easy and delicious idea. Check this out. There's just something about lasagna that puts everybody in a good mood. Do you think so too? Uh, I bet you never thought that a wonton wrapper could be used to make lasagna. Yep, that's what we're gonna do today. We are gonna make mini lasagnas. And I love this because I am hosting a bridal shower in a couple months. So I've been testing a few of these appetizer recipes on my husband and the kids. And this is one that is just too good not to share. I love to keep wonton wrappers in the fridge because you can seal them up, sweet, savory, fry them, put them in the air fryer, the oven uh, and something yummy a filling yummy filling is always inside a wrapper like this what we're doing here today is we're bringing in all those flavors from the lasagna but we're making them into individual portions that can be enjoyed at a picnic or a cocktail hour or like what I'm doing a bridal shower so what I did was I sauteed uh, a pound of ground pork with my favorite uh, marinara sauce I think I use actually a vodka sauce for this one look at this beautiful color a uh, real simple so all the spices flavorings just right there in the sauce with that brown ground pork. I let that cool a bit and now it's ready. It's time to build these little lasagnas. So we're starting with a little bit of this sauce. And what we're gonna do is we're going to spoon a little bit of sauce into there. Be sure not to overfill these, okay? Because we want them to be bite-sized. We want them to be kind of cocktail size, right? I'm putting a little flavor of herbed cream cheese right there. You can use ricotta or cottage cheese as well. And then a little bit of Italian cheese. Okay, this is where the fun part comes in. We're putting in another wonton wrapper and we're gonna stuff it down there. Okay, and then we're just gonna start building once again. Two layers, real simple. And this one recipe makes about 36 to 48 of these mini lasagnas. Keep some warm in the oven, just serve them as the guests come. Look at how great that is. Now what, what's cool about this is that the edges are going to crisp up really nicely, but everything else inside is going to stay super creamy, super kind of flexible, like a lasagna noodle should be, right? So this is such a fun recipe to keep on hand at any time of the year. Everyone loves lasagna, right? You can't go wrong with something like this. For this recipe, go to coldpork.org and follow us on social media at Colorado Pork Producers Council.